Gambit. But the way they have it spelled out is actually King Ambit. You can either say King Gambit or King Ambit. <laughs> it feels so weird that it doesn't have two G's on it. Oh, she doesn't have Cyclone anymore. A Whirlwind, I mean. That's unfortunate. I had to trade him back because I needed access to Whirlwind. Doing the end game turning over and over again with the Ambit coin is the best way to farm money. You think I'll just 150k each time? And not the Elite Four? to go and fight the root trainers yeah there's a lot of root trainers that i haven't done yet what happened It's a cookie. I got the cookie. All if you hear me, uh. I got the cookie. All if you hear me, uh. You hate Geek to Design? I actually enjoy Geek to Design. <laughs> I do wish he had more of a figure, but uh, I mean, whatever. That's personal preference, right? I will say, I feel like she might have too much hair, though. She reminds me of a Super Saiyan 3 with all her hair. Makes sense. You like, you hate it, I like it. <laughs> it's almost as if I'm doing this on purpose. Super Saiyan 3 G, uh, go, uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gita. You excited about Tekken 8? Yeah. I can't wait for that. I can't wait for Street Fighter 6. Can't wait for Final Fantasy 16. Luckily, I get 20 days to play Street Fighter before uh, Final Fantasy comes out. It's like I get to actually like, get in there and, and enjoy a bit of Street Fighter before I have to put it down for uh, Final Fantasy. Yo, did she just drain that puppy's HP? Ha, I made it. Um, I think I'm supposed to do... Douse. Douse into...
cross. You didn't see 16? It was probably the last thing they showed at the Game Awards. If I remember correctly, it was like the very last thing they showed before they did the, the Game of the Year announcement. So it's like super late into it. Did Tinka Tough make my team's cut? Um, I... No, not really. Not because I didn't want her on my team. It's just because I wanted to make an even balance of attackers and defenders. Uh, attackers, defenders, supporter. So I think right now I'm aiming to have one physical attacker, one special attacker, one or two defenders, and one or two supporters, depending on how many defenders I have on my team. I think I want like a tank buff to supporter and a, uh, a healer. Her speed is a bit I mean, she's a heavy behind metal monster. Of course her speed's gonna be a bit small. It's still better than gar uh, Garganical speed. I think her, fail her failure comes into the fact that she doesn't have really good special defense. And from what I'm understanding, her base attack is uh, caps low. I think she's fun. This is true. Velusa does have terrible speed, considering the fact that it like propels itself right at you in in the overworld, like Charpedo. It's almost to the point where I think that might be a bug. <laughs> that's gotta be a bug, right? Whoa, 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 ha, ha. Okay, I was just curious where it would lead me. There's no Pokemon you hate more in this game than Eliza. What Pokemon is that? The loser. Okay, I was like, who's Eliza? That's hilarious. I did not know that was a thing that could happen. I actually made it. Let's go. Yeah, I'm not a fan of Veluza either. But no, if I had to pick a Pokemon in this game that I, in this generation, I mean, if I had to pick a Pokemon in this game that I hate the most, it's still uh, Greedon.
Nothing in the world will ever get rid of my hatred of greed. Blues always gets in the way of you trying to hunt uh, Don Dozo and uh, Tatsugiri. You like greeting? You poor, you poor soul. Yeah, I figured it was greeting that you were trying to say. You poor soul. Gre is greeting holding you captive by chance? get a treasure chest mind you this is all literally just to get a treasure chest there might be a good item in here I want a weapon that is not a weapon nor is that armor pixie oh no those are fairies that's definitely not a pixie I got a vial and I got a nut. I got a vial nut. <laughs> oh dang, it's 11 18. Do I catch my shinies in any particular ball? I always try a quick ball at the start. And if that doesn't work, then no, no, no particular ball in particular. So whatever ball best suits the situation. At night, it's usually going to be in a dusk ball, and during the day, it's usually going to be in an ultra ball. And whenever I do a terror raid battle and I catch a Pokemon in that, it's usually going to be in a premier ball. That's just because you always get so many premier balls. Um, and since it's a guaranteed catch with the uh, the terror rates, I figured I might as well just waste the premier balls on that. Oh, he got whopped. Whop, whop, whop. <laughs> so we came down here only to get an item. That's literally all this was. I don't even know where I'm at anymore. Alright, so now we douse this. Just sold a bunch of ability capsules for 250k. Yeah, I, I, I guess patches are better, right? When you use an ability patch, does it let you choose which ability you get?
Okay, retreat! We've now officially finished in Capo Popo Pow Poo Poo the Swamp. We no longer have a reason to be here. Okay. But it does let you choose what the what ability you pick, right? It doesn't just randomly give you one of the two new abi uh, other abilities. Because if it was random, I'd be really sad. Garo. I don't need to go back to Garo. I don't need to go back to Mikasala either. Yeah, I guess the Shrine of the Sea God is where we're going next, right? Backwards ability patch allows you to change to the hidden ability. It captures and switches your ability to the other ability that you don't currently have, excluding hidden. Okay. Yeah, I was I was hoping the patch would let you pick between your hidden ability or the other two abilities. Uh, 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 uh. Alright, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna head towards We're gonna head towards uh the Shrine of the Sea God. Once we get there, I think that's what we'll save and we'll call it quits for the night. Um I wanna get some ice cream and such and before I fall asleep, so Capsule is disposable, whereas you want to hold on to patches. I mean, I guess I. It depends on the Pokemon, right? Not all Pokemon you want to have their hidden ability. Like for instance, Miascarada, I don't want to have her hidden ability. Um, for Miascarada, I believe I think I just want to keep uh Overgrowth. Uh, and that's just because they really nerfed protein. Patches are one percent drop rate from the raids. Yeah, I heard it was really, really small. Which is a shame. But I guess they need to give you a reason to keep coming back and farming these raids. That's sweet 11 experience. I feel oh so powerful now. 
I'm a god because I got 11 experience. And none, no one can tell me otherwise. I gotta grab this tear because I need it for the, uh, the place. I need it for the, uh, shrine. Yeah, and it's just because Flower Trick is so potent. I might actually do the same thing, uh, Shiny Beat Masquerada, if I can just bottle cap the rest of the stats to where I need them to be. I'm debating if I want to take this other uh, Sprigatito and evolve it all the way up um, to make the breeding easier. I don't. I can't remember if Sprigatito itself can breed. I, I imagine it can. Because if it can, then I probably won't waste the time in doing it the other way that I was planning on doing it. Shiny breeding is, breeding is pointless in this game with the exception of uh, Zard and Starters. That depends. If you're shiny breeding for competitive, maybe, but... A lot of people prefer, like, shiny breeding for live for living decks as well, because it's just it's easier than trying to find them in the overworld map. It doesn't require you to do too much walking. Like, I I watched this dude shiny breeding for the entirety of the Dratini line. Yes? In terms of finding a shiny in the overworld map, it's definitely much easier to do that. Um, but outside of a mass outbreak, you don't know what shiny you're gonna get. It could just be a random shiny, can it be another one of the shinies that you've already had before, you know? With, with shiny breeding, at least you know you're gonna get the exact shiny that you were looking for from the get-go. As opposed to it just being a random shiny on the overworld. So I'm just to make it super easy. I think this is a dead end right here. Oh no, it's not. This is where I wanted to be. I couldn't do anything here before because I didn't have peers um, for his ability to cast frost. I call it isolated shiny hunting. Well, 
this place just got cooler looking. Found that shiny iron hands in 10 seconds after using a sandwich to make it so we he was the only thing spotting in that area. Eating sandwiches saves lives. That's what I heard. That's what I'm hearing. Eating sandwiches saves lives. I need to go and hunt a uh, roaring moon. There we go. This is the path we needed. Reveal. I was not supposed to complete this tonight. I was supposed to end at the start of this. I need to go to Magma Rock. Alright, it's the first of the Trident pieces. Oh my god! For the love of god, face the thing! Well, that was quick. <laughs> Next. All right, so next we want to go up around here ish, I believe. Yeah. So we're gonna go due north from here. Just straight up. I believe there should be another uh trident piece over there. I took four and one. I said before making a sandwich and don't save. I say before making a sandwich and don't save unless I get at least two shinies. Otherwise not worth using the uh the HM. You don't like using up all your salty agents? Can I do that? Uh, let's see what that happens. Oh, it didn't matter. I think I have some salty ones on me, but that's about it. So we made it to Champa. I did not want to come here yet. Viking hell. Resist water. 
160 to 172, 180 to 192. We'll give it to him. I mean, he already resists water, so basically water's a non-factor to him. Isaac! Uh, not quite, not quite. Isaac, is that you? Do you mind deceive me? Yes, they deceive you. Oh, I must have been mistaken. Young lady, are you looking for someone by the name of Isaac? Yes, old man, I am looking for one called Isaac. Where is Isaac? I'm sorry, Isaac isn't with us. Well then, where can I find Isaac? Why do you want to find him so badly? Me? I am Feiji. Isaac helped me once. He helped, he helped Ulmuch. Ulmuch was trapped, but Isaac saved him. He's a brave man, isn't he? Why is his name Ulmuch? <laughs> I suppose. But why are you looking for him? Do you like him? Is that it? You're a mean old man. It is not polite to tease me. That's what it is. You like Isaac. No, I am so... No, I'm so embarrassed. Don't worry, Feiji. We'll tell Isaac how you feel. I... Really? What well, then... Will you give him this when you meet um, tell him? What is it? Isaac's on a dangerous journey. I am worried about him. So I made him a good luck charm. Ah, a good luck charm. I see. I'm going home now, old man. Thank you for doing the same for me. Well, that was kind of mean of him. He didn't have to tease her like that. Raises all elemental resistances. Well, you know I'm going to give it to him, right? I'm not supposed to be here yet. And that is a definite. I am not supposed to be here yet. Also, my bags are filled with crap again. It happened so quickly. I see you've caught up with me again, Felix. God darn it. Alex! Alex, who's Alex? Alex is a water adept. We had been traveling together, but he left us when we landed on Andra. A water adept? Ah, and I see you've made a new friend. You have been busy, haven't you? Yep. And you found yourself a new water adept. Do you mean to cast me away like old trash? What do you mean? With us now, um, what do you want with us now, Alex? Or did you forget you were the one who abandoned us? My dear Jenna, have you come to despise me so after um, all we've been through? Yep. That's right, Felix. Why should we care about someone who left, left us behind like that? My, aren't we a bitter bunch? And I was just trying to help you with your little task. We have no need of your help. We can light the lighthouses without you. Oh, can you really? Karst. That's right, Karst. Karst. I'm glad you remembered me. What is this, Alex? What's going on? Ah, how can I explain this? What's going on is Alex is demonstrating his remarkable foresight once again. Oh, have you not had the pleasure of an introduction? He stayed back at the ship when I saw them in Madra. I'm a, um... Agashio. Let's see. That guy's Felix and the girls are Jenna and Shiva, which makes him cred. They look like an unreliable bunch of ragamuffins. Yes, they are rather useless, aren't they? That's why I finally had to abandon them, of course. But now I believe I may have been hasty in my judgment. You are peers. How do you know my name? How soon they forget? We met you before when you were being detained. We could, um, who could forget the amateur adept changing water to, um, to ice in that strange little town? Ah, you saw that. That must be how you knew Pierce was a water adept. In fact, I was even thinking of borrowing a ship at one point. You would steal someone's boat? That's, super, that's so typical, Alex. You wound me, Jenna. I only meant to borrow it. Whatever you might have meant, that doesn't make it right. And just when I was supposed, to, uh, just about to seize the opportunity, you had to come back. You mean from, you mean from Kimbambo? I was m mere moments too late. Isn't that a shame? 
Still, because of that, I did meet Carson Agito. Uh, so perhaps it was my fate. Can you just stop talking about yourself for one second, Alex? Enough of your childish jibes, Alex. I want to know what makes these punks useful. Because they brought us the orb that Akafubu had taken. That shows more of some resourcefulness. How so? The Kebab are quite warlike, or were, at any rate. Recovering that orb were, was most likely not easy. They were just typical villagers, easily frightened with a small display of synergy. No, they would have used less abrupt methods than those um, you favor. Oh, what methods would those be? Alex said it clearly enough. We wouldn't terrorize people into doing what we wanted. Enough of this! Stop changing the subject! When are you going to light the remaining lighthouses? Yes, our patience is beginning to wear thin. If you waste much more of our time, we'll take the elemental stars and do it ourselves. If we had a wind adept like Shiva and the elemental stars, we wouldn't need you. Excuse me? I am, of course, opposed to the line of thinking. My experience with Satros and, uh, uh, Satros and Minority suggests that while they were fierce warriors, they're, they are somewhat lacking when it comes to solving the mysteries of the lighthouse. Uh, lighthouses, my bad. You mean to say that they failed to solve the riddles? Miserably. Are you suggesting they were simple brutes and capable of logic and intelligence? Are you saying the same of, um, of us? I'm afraid so. Alex, whose side are you on? I am on no one's side. My only concern is to see the lighthouse beacons lit once again. So you mean to leave the task to Felix? Then why have you come all this way looking for Felix? I really wanted to confirm that he had his uh, he and his companions had not forgotten their quest. Is that truly all? I also wanted to introduce Felix to the two of you. Why would you want to do that? While Satros and Minority uh, with Satros and Minority gone, you probably felt very little pressure to complete your task. I cannot have that. What do you mean by that? With Satros and Minority gone, I felt another pair might, how should I put this, provide you with the proper incentive to complete your task. Is that some kind of threat? Take it as you wish. I just wanted to provide you with the proper encouragement. So what? You've used us um, to your satisfaction and now your, our role is done? You only wanted us around to flex a little muscle and scare them into action? Fine. I suppose we'll let you go today. But we will always be nearby, pushing you to make your way to Jupiter Lighthouse swiftly. I look forward to seeing you soon, Felix. Somewhere near, somewhere very near Jupiter Lighthouse. Cred, am I right? In, um, in recalling that you pursue this quest on behalf of Toby's ruler, Bobby. This is true. I'm studying alchemy because Lord Bobby has ordered it. What about it? Ah, what a pity. It would seem all your studies have been for naught. What are you getting at, Alex? Only that it seems your Lord Bobby has la at last succumbed to the ravages of time. Lord Bobby is dead? Oh, so you didn't know? Lord Bobby, dead? Could that, really, could that really be true? Alex, how would you know such a thing? Do not mistake me. We had no hand in Bobby's passing. However, the people of Toby may be under the impression that our presence led to his death. Alex, cut the melodrama and get to the point for a change. Simply put, I would recommend against traveling to North Gondolan for a while. I just thought it might be better to... Um, if you focus on your quest instead of ex exploration for now. How kind of you. Take it as you will. Very well. May we meet again. Yo, Alex is prime, or not prime, grade A butt wipe. He is a grade A butt wipe. So he didn't kill Bobby. He died because he ran out of his draw. But Alex went there and it made it seem like he was involved in his death. Perhaps he had his own reasons for telling Crad. What do you mean, Pierce? If Crad undertook this quest on behalf of Bobby, then he no longer has any need. Oh, of course. I hadn't thought of that. Your orders were to find Lemuria, um, Lemuria right, Crad? That's right, but if Bobby really has died, you're free to go where you will, uh, Crad. That's not true, Shiba. Certainly my original reason for researching alchemy was Lord Bobby. 
was. That's your that's past tense. What are your reasons now? This is no longer solely for research. I do this because um I do this because of what I've learned on this quest. Your research? What you learned on this quest? I'm not following you at all. I don't understand a word of this. Of course you don't. Felix is the only one I have spoken to uh, spoken to about any of this. What? You knew? That's not fair. Tell us. Please, Felix. Let's not say too much about this just yet. It's far too complicated. Cratton is going to learn very quickly that you shouldn't withhold information from uh, ladies. Well, what will you tell us? I am sure we will tell you once we get to Lemuria. Do you promise? I promise. Pierce, you don't mind waiting. I cannot read minds like Shiva, but I have a guess at, at what you're thinking. A guess? What do you mean? You are a great scholar, Crichton, are you not? I believe your theory is correct, and to prove it, I want to return to Lemuria as soon as possible. AKA Pierce is smart. And not at all dumb. Okay, so.